Hello, 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 class. Good evening. Good evening, Good evening teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening, teacher. How are you guys? How are you telling me? Is everything okay? Yes. How are you telling me? Yes. I'm oh, fine. Good. Excellent. Okay, we're going to begin with the class, everybody. But first, you know, I need to, as attendance, remember once you listen to your name, stay present. Okay, let's begin. Here we go. Alejandro. Present teacher. Thank you. Claudia. Present teacher. Okay, tell me. Okay. Oh, here. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's go with Eduardo. I'm sorry, Eddie. Present teacher. Thank you. Eduardo? Present teacher. Evelyn? Evelyn? Present. Thank you. Fatima? Fatima? Present, teacher. Thanks. Zelda Garcia? Present. Thank you. Zelda Garcia? Zelda Mendoza? Present, teacher. Thanks. Ingrid? Ingrid? Here. It is? Present, teacher. Yeah. Here being present teacher. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Present teacher. Got it. Present teacher. Yeah. Kevin. Present teacher. Thank you. Yeah. Present teacher. Thanks. Marta. Mirna Batres. Mirna Batres. Present teacher. Mercedes. Present teacher. Mirna Zuniga. Present teacher. Thanks. Norma. Norma. Anora? Present teacher. Thank you. Oscar. Oscar. Present teacher. Here. Paula. Present. Thanks. Orlando. Present teacher. Thank you. William. Present teacher. Mason. Jennifer. Present teacher. And Yolanda. Present teacher. Thank you. Eo Adelmi. Present teacher. Thank you. Eo Ingrid. Okay, very good. So we, we have full house. Very good. Thank you. Thank you for being here, guys. We're going to begin with the class. So first, I want to take some screenshots. Please, can you switch on the cameras? Vamos a enseñar nuestras cámaras. Ok, vamos. Vos me pueden ayudar. Vamos a la falta de tres. Voy a tomar solo dos capturas. Uno, dos, tres. Ok. Vamos con la otra. A ver, voy a tomar porque salió algo. Movido. Vamos a cantar. Uno, dos, tres. Ahora sí. Y vamos con la otra. 
Lo digo. De tres, uno, dos, tres. Okay, thank you. Good. All right. Thank you for joining. Let's begin. Let me display presentation. And well, I need to know uh, how's everything telling me? Ready to the platform? Is everything good? Hemos completado la sección 3. Vamos a vamos. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Hemos hecho el meeting. Yes, Thank you. Yes. There. Yes. yes. Excellent. I like it. I like it. Recuerden que tenemos hasta las hasta la medianoche prácticamente para poder completar la sección 3 y el meter. Ok. Semana 1, semana 2, sección 1, 2 y 3. Semana 3, que sería la próxima, un lunes, la próxima semana, sería sección 4. Y semana 4 sería sección 5. En la plataforma. ¿eh? Okay. Ahora finalizamos con la semana 2, con la sección 3. La próxima semana estaríamos con la sección 4 y semana 3. ¿Ok? Es que si no hemos completado el meter, les invito a que lo hagamos con tiempo, lo hagamos una vez que finalizamos la clase. Porque debe estar completo ese día, al igual que las expresiones de ¿Okay? No sé si alguien más ha tenido problemas con la plataforma. ¿Cómo oh, vamos? ¿Está todo bien? Teacher, entonces... Eh... Para ahora solo sería la 1, la 2 y la 3 de la plataforma, sí. ¿verdad? Sí. Ah, ok. Si ustedes, si ustedes desean avanzar más, claro, pueden hacerlo. Avanzar más, ya iniciar con la sección 4. Si hay algunos ya iniciaron, probablemente, está bien. Pueden seguir. Pueden seguir. La idea es que completen la plataforma y completen el 70%. Por supuesto, vamos a estar reportando todos los temas acá. Muy bien. Ok. Mercedes. También para hoy es lo del meter. Sí. Oh, oh. El meter lo hacemos jueves. Bueno, en este caso, pues la semana va bien. El lunes a jueves. Porque a veces cambia. Cuando, por ejemplo, ya suelto. Algo que para el grupo anterior. Y teníamos el próximo de la semana. Ya no era de lunes a jueves. Fue por el suelto, si no me equivoco, el día de la madre. Lo subió. Y ahora sí iniciamos el lunes a jueves, vamos de lunes a jueves la semana. Estamos bien. Eh, el meeting se hace el jueves. El final exam, que es el en la última semana, ese se hace antes. Se hace miércoles. Porque ya para el jueves tiene que estar todo completo. Es que se los anticipo. Esto lo voy a explicar hasta la última semana. Les voy a explicar el final test, el final exam, que es el último examen. Pero eso sí, se hace antes, se hace miércoles, no jueves, porque ya el jueves tiene que estar todo completo. ¿Ok? ¿Si ¿Alguien más tiene alguna consulta? ¿No? No iniciamos. Ok, well, today... Guys, it's Thursday, May 27th. We finished with the second week. Okay, the second week. Today we will have class in a second. I'm verifying something. Yeah, it's class number eight. Sorry. Class number eight. Okay, it's class number eight. Today we will have these okay. topics. We will talk about numbers and ages and adjectives. Numbers and ages and adjectives. Okay? 
Let's begin. We'll begin with the numbers. Numbers. We have numbers from one to 100. We we'll continue. We have from 103 because I'm going to play the audio that I have in the platform. Okay. But we have numbers from 100, from one, sorry, from one to 100. And we're, we're going to learn the numbers. We have the numbers. And I think I'm going to move on to the platform because I need you to listen to the audio, listen to the numbers, and then we're gonna practice together with some questions, okay? Vamos a escuchar los números. Voy a ponerles el audio en la plataforma. Lo voy a incluir el audio. Okay, here we go. All right, these are the numbers, okay? We're going to listen to the audio because the speaker is going to mention the numbers one by one. And then we're going to practice with some questions. I need to focus on the numbers, please, okay? Let me know if you can listen to the audio, please. Listen and repeat. Can you listen to the audio? Vamos al audio? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay. Yes, listen to the teacher. No? Well, no. Right now, I, I stop it. Ahorita lo, 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 lo detuve. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Listen to the numbers, please. Listen to the numbers. Here we have from 11 to 103, okay? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 101, 102, 103. Now is your turn to practice. Here, okay. Now let's go here. All right. Well, we have first from one to 10, right? Now listen to me. Listen to me and we're going to practice one more time. Listen and repeat, okay? Escuchemos y repitamos, pero si gustan, Podemos tener nuestro micrófono apagado por un momento para que podamos escuchar bien. Luego, si gusta, podemos encender nuestro micrófono. ¿okay? Here we go. Pero sí quiero que repita. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And we continue, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 30, 30, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 
36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 40, 40, 40, 41, again, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. You can, if you can listen to me, we go on this way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and we change. Now let's go with 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 60, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 70, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 80, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 88, 89, 90, 90, listen, 90, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 99, and then we have 100, 100, 100, say 101, 102, 103, and we continue, okay? Those are the numbers from one to 100. And as you can see, we follow the same sequence. Eduardo, yeah. Excuse me, teacher. Este, cuando decimos 100, podemos decir 101, or siempre tiene que ser 101. Some people say 101, 101, and it's okay. It's okay. But, we tend to say 100, 100, and we include N, N, 1, 101, 102. But some people say, for example, 101, 101, 102, 103. But most of the times we say 101, 102, 103, 104. 105, 106, we continue, okay? Listen, with these numbers, remember 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and we have 100, right? With those numbers, we say 20, and then we continue. 21, 21, I want you to pay attention to the way we write the number in letters, okay? Number in letters. Numbers in letters. 20, 21, continue. 22, 
Twenty three. Twenty four. Twenty five. Twenty six. Twenty seven. Twenty eight. Twenty eight. Twenty nine. Twenty nine. And we finish with, well, in this case, we continue with thirty. 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 Thirty one. We go again. Thirty one. 31. We continue 32, 33, 34, until 40. 41, 42, 43. Okay? We go on that way. We follow the sequence. Seguimos esa, vamos en esa secuencia, okay? That's the way we say belongs. All right? Questions about this? Numbers? Teacher, el número 30, ¿cuál es la correcta pronunciación? Creo que ese es el que más me, como que... Mm -mm. 30, 30. 30. So you, you, put, you put your tongue between your teeth. Mm -hmm. 30, 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. Yes. Okay. Hey. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. Listen. Of course, we have this one, right? This is a zero. 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 Right? Let's go with the numbers. Listen again. Please listen and repeat. One. Being zero. Zero. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve, thirteen, 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 thirteen. Look at me, look at my mouth. Thirteen, thirteen. 13, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 20. Some people say 20 or 20. Both are correct. Okay? 20, 20. Both are correct. Okay? I'm going to say 20. 20, 30, 30, 30, 30, 40, 40, 50, 50, 60, 60, 70, 70, 80, 80, 90, 90, 100, 100, 100, okay? Those are the numbers. And of course we use them because we want to express some information, right, about us. For example, we use the numbers, we use the numbers. Let's go with some questions. We have some WS questions. We will include WS questions with B. Remember? With the verb be. Am, um, are, is. Okay? And we have those words. How? How old are you? How old are you? How old are you? I am 26 years old. I am 26 years old. How old are you? I am 26 years old. Okay? How old are you? I am 26 years old. Okay, 
but it's a WS question. And we want to get information about a person or people, okay? For example, Rolando, how old are you? I am 33 years old. 33 years old, okay, very good. Mirna Suniga, how old are you? How old are you, Mirna Sonica? I am. Twenty. Twenty seven. Twenty seven years old. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Thank you, Mirna. What about? Yes. Yes. Thank you, William. How old are you? I am 20, 21 years old. Okay. Thank you. What about Iris? Iris, how old are you? I am 29. 29? Years old. Years old. Okay. You 29. are 29 years old. Good, Iris. Uh, let's see. Let's continue with Josue. Uh, Iris. Can you ask the question to Josue? How old are you? How old are you? It is? Um, yeah. Josue, how old are you? How old are you? I am 34 years old. 34 years old, good. Okay, listen again, listen to the question. How old are you? 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 Jennifer, how old are you? I am 24 years old. Okay, awesome. We can have, you know, different, different questions, right? For example, we want to know more information about family members. For example, how old, how old is your mother? Mother is okay, 53 years old. Okay, how old is your mother? How old is your mother? My mother is 53 years old. That is another question, right? We continue with ages. Tenemos con edades, right? How old is your mother? For example, if I ask uh, Kevin, how old is your mother? Uh, my mother is um, mm, 48. 48 years old. Years old. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that happens, that happens, Kevin. Uh, Kevin, choose another classmate. Let's find out okay. um, uh, Alejandro. Alejandro, okay. Kevin, can oh. you ask a question to Alejandro? Okay. How old is your mother? How old is your mother? Thank you. My mother is 59 years old. 59 years old. Excellent, Alejandro. Alejandro, choose another classmate. Uh, mother. My mother is 59 years old. Okay, repeat again. Paula, how old is your mother, Paula? My mother is 59 years old. Okay. Yeah, very good. My mother is 59 years old. Thank you, Paula. Paula, can you select another class of this? So. Griselda. Griselda Garcia or Mendoza, sorry? Eh, Mendoza. Mendoza, okay. The same question, Paula. 
Griselda, how old is your mother? Yes. My mother is 67 years old. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, listen. That is one of the, the questions that we can use and we can include numbers, right? We use numbers. 26, 53, 59, 48, better, okay? we have another one. What about if I ask you for your phone numbers? Wax your phone number. Okay. And that is a different question. And we're using another WH word. What is the WH word? What? What? Okay. Wax. We're asking for phone numbers, right? Phone numbers. What? Your phone number. Phone number. What is the way we say it? Listen to me. My phone number is 6015-2385, okay? When we are giving numbers, phone numbers, we tend to say this one as O, the O, okay? We don't, I mean, some people say zero, but we tend to say O, O, okay? My oh. phone number is six, six oh, oh one, one five, five two three eight five. And we say number by number. Decimos número por número. Sin embargo, hay personas que lo dicen combinado, like 60, 15, 23, 85. But the correct way is number by number. Número por número, okay? What's your phone number? My phone number is 6015-2385. Okay? What's your phone number? My phone number is 6015-2385. Okay? Let's see. Let's practice. Oscar, what's your phone number? And my phone number is 7 zero uh, five five three six six three okay very good uh remember you can say o o instead of zero o okay o o estamos usando los números de 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 teléfono utilizamos o para el cero o sin embargo hay personas que dicen zero zero Okay, it's okay. Thank you. So, Oscar. Solo para nombre de tel, número de teléfono, teacher. Mm. Oh. Let me see. Well, if you're giving a, an ID, for example, estamos haciendo una identificación, en los casos del el DUI, se puede también decir eso. Para identificaciones así, por ejemplo, para carnets, a uh, otra identificación, utilizamos O. Oh. O, oh. okay. Yeah. And some people tend to say the numbers like this. For example, this one. So people tend to say one, oh, five. One, five. But they say number by number. Oh, oh, one, oh, five. One, oh, five. And we know that it is one hundred, oh, and five. One hundred and five. Some people say one, oh, five. Como que lo deletrean. Y también se, se escucha bastante, es, puede ser válido. Okay. 105. Okay. All right, see. Oscar, select another participant, please. Alguien que no participa. Oscar. Uh, edit. Edit, okay. okay. Yeah. Um, Oscar, ask the question to Edit. What? What's your phone number? Yes, thank you. What's your phone number, Edit? What is the question? The same. What's your phone number, Edit? My number. 
Ah, okay. My phone number is six one eight three yeah. seven one five uh, four. Yeah, amazing. Thank you, Edith. Edith, can you select another person, please? Black person. All right. Oh my gosh, I'm not Repeat, please. Yeah, can you choose another classmate? Voy a seleccionar a otro participante. Ah, ok. Eh, Yolanda. Eh, Yolanda del Carmen. Yeah. What's your phone number? Good idea. Eh, Thank you. My phone number is 746 five eight seven four eight yeah very good thank you Yolanda what about Ingrid what's your phone number Ingrid my phone number is 79 26 08 15 okay very good very good thank you Ingrid Norma, what's your number? Uh, my phone number is uh, 716472268. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Rolando, what's your number? My phone number is 739666. Uh, nine seven one. Exactly. Thank you. And Marta, what's your phone number, Marta? Marta, I think you have the microphone now. Can I make it for Paula? What's my your phone, phone number? Yeah. My my phone my phone number is seven five. O nine five three five nine. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Thank you, Martha. Well, uh, guys, questions about this numbers? Preguntas? Teacher, I have a question. Sure, tell me. And when the phone number have two number follow, for example, top O. Like my, my phone number is um seven six o two o o five four. Yeah. Yeah, you can say yeah seven six o two o o five four. I think you're asking me for the, the same number, right? We have many times. For example, like this. Yes. Yeah, you can say my phone number is six o o o one two three four. We can say it. Okay. I can say uh, six three o one two three mm. four. Knowing that way, I mean, yeah, we tend to say in Spanish like that, right? Uh, seis, treceros, por ejemplo. Yeah, we're saying that in a way. But in English, it's not common. I mean, by six, then we, I have three, not, three zeros, but it's not common. Probably, probably you can say like 6,000. Vamos a decirlo así, quizás. Como todo completo, la cantidad. 6,000, 12, 34. O los decimos en combinación a veces, 22, etc. Okay? Probablemente podría ser así, 6,000. But it is much better if you say number by number. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Teacher, okay. Yeah, tell me. Uh, what is the different? Um, 
zero and all? Well, we know that the number is zero, zero. But in English, we use O, O for, for numbers, ideas, etc. Mm, okay. Yeah. Tendemos a usar el O en inglés, que sabemos que el número es cero. Tendemos a usar O. Okay. Ya es según la regla. Entonces, por eso decimos 6015-23-85. Es recomendable decirlo el número por número. Aunque hay personas que utilizan las combinaciones. 60, 15, 23, 85. Okay. Right. Uh, questions, guys? One more time. Questions about the numbers? <laughs> Everything is clear? Estamos claros en este momento? ¿Todo bien? Yes, teacher. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Moving on now, we change. We change now the. Uh, the topic now let's go with adjectives let's begin with a definition what is an adjective what is an adjective guys what is an adjective adjective an adjective is a word that describes a noun or a pronoun such as person a place Thing or idea. That is an adjective. Okay? So we can describe a person, we can describe a, a place, we can describe an animal, we can describe a thing, an object, etc. Okay? And we can have different adjectives like, you know, happy, uh, small, etc. Here I have some adjectives that we're going to use in this class. Let's begin. The first two, we have tall and short. Tall and short. In this case, we're talking about the height. Oh, height. Alto, tall, 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 short. Okay? Tall, tall, short. short. We're talking about the height. Estamos hablando de la altura. Tall, height. I'm sorry, tall, short. Tall, so, those are adjectives. Okay. Let's go with two more. Quiet. 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 Look at the woman. Quiet. And look at the, the boy. Talkative. Talkative. We can say talkative or we can say talkative. Talkative. Quiet, talkative. Quiet is the opposite of talkative. Talkative. When someone likes speaking, so they speak a lot. They speak a lot. Okay, when alguien le gusta hablar bastante, saca bastante plática, it's talkative. He is talkative, she is talkative. Quiet is the opposite. Is the opposite. Okay, the person is timid or the person is shy. But he, he or she is not sociable. Okay. Quiet, again. Listen, quiet. Quiet. Talkative. Or talkative. Next. We have Hanson. Hanson. He is Hanson. The man, the man is Hanson. Handsome. Okay? But that is for men. That adjective is for men. For women, we can say, do you know? Beautiful. Beautiful. In this case, I have pretty. So pretty. 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 Yeah, as, as a son, right? Pretty woman. Okay? Pretty woman. Pretty. Handsome. Pretty. The man is handsome. The woman is pretty. Pretty. Handsome. Pretty. Okay. Next. Look at the woman. Good looking. Good looking, okay? Good looking. He is good looking. 
Okay, look at her hair, look at his, her face, look at her clothes. It's good looking. Good looking. What about the guy? So the, the man is friendly. The man is friendly because he likes to be sociable. Okay, he greets other people. He greets other people. He says, hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Bye. See you tomorrow. He is friendly. Okay. Again, good looking. Good looking. Friendly. Friendly. Next, we have heavy. 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 The man, the man is heavy. The man is heavy. On the other hand, we have thin, thin, thin. Heavy, heavy, thin, thin, thin. Heavy, thin. Okay. Next. Look at the man. So the man is serious. Serious. The man is serious. Serious. Okay. Serious. Serious. We have the opposite. Okay. Jim Carrey is funny. Jim Carrey is funny. Jim Carrey is funny. Funny. And we have another one which is hi. 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 For example, when people don't like speaking in public because they are shy. They are shy. They are timid. They don't like speaking in public. Okay, because they are shy. Okay, these are some adjectives. Some adjectives. And we use them in order to describe people, places, things, animals, objects, ideas. Let's go again. Listen to me and repeat. Tall. Tall. Torn. Torn. Quiet. Quiet. Talkative. Talkative. Handsome. Handsome. Pretty. Pretty, good looking, good looking, friendly, friendly, heavy, heavy, thin, 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 serious, serious, funny, funny, high, high. Questions about the adjectives? Teacher. Yeah. He is shy or he's high? High. 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 No, no high. Shy. Ah, okay. Shy. 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 Nice. Somebody else? Thanks. Yes. You're welcome. Let me give you some examples. How we use them in sentences. For example, look at the man. In my case, I am tall. I am tall. I am not sure. I'm not sure. I am tall. I'm not sure. Okay. Uh, Alejandro, I think you have a question, sorry. No, no. Oh, okay, okay. I am tall. I'm not sure. That's for me, I mean, that's my example. I am tall, I'm not sure. Another one, the, my mother is very pretty. My mother is very pretty, okay? My mother is very pretty, very pretty. Next, my friend John is funny. Well, as you know, we, we know the actor, 
King Kerry is funny. King Kerry is funny. Okay. My friend John is funny. Funny. Only one, my sister Jane is good looking. My sister Jane is good looking. We are describing people now, right? We're describing people. First, we can describe objects, but we can describe animals. For example, my cell phone is what? It's expensive, for example. Just an example. My cell phone is expensive. So we're describing uh, the cell phone, right? And the, the adjective is expensive. Expensive. That is an adjective. Expensive. We're talking about money. Money. Price. Or my cell phone is new. It's new. Okay. My cell phone is new. All right. The yeah, idea have more examples. No. That is the last one. Okay. Any questions? Can you give me some examples, by the way? I want to listen to you. Can you give me some examples, please? Follow the examples, follow these examples, and I need you to give me your own examples. Who wants to try? Volunteers? Podríamos compartir un par de ejemplos? Who wants to try? Volunteer? Orlando, let's go with you. Thank you. My bed is ready. Okay, my pet is pretty. Listen, with pets, let's say dogs, cats, etc., we tend to use cute. Cute. My pet is cute. My dog is cute. My pet is cute. And it is a, a let's say a, an equivalence of beautiful, pretty, as you said. But we tend to use this one for animal. Cute. My pet is cute. My dog, my dog is cute. My cat is cute. My parrot is cute. Okay. Well, that's a nice example. Thank you, Orlando. Somebody else? Orlando, thank you. And then English. I, I have a question, teacher. Oh, yeah, sure. Tell me. Uh, are the colors adjective? Yeah, yeah, good. Yeah, colors are adjectives. We can say, for example, my computer is black. Yeah, my computer is black. My backpack is is white, okay? My backpack is white. So yeah, colors are adjectives. White, yellow, blue, purple, etc. Very good. Thank you for the question, Yolanda. I will go with Ingrid. Yeah. I think Ingrid wants to say one example. Then Kevin will tell me. Uh, my brother is heavy. Okay. My brother is heavy. I want to clarify something because when we say we have fat and we are heavy, fat, when we say in, in, in Spanish, right? Gordo. Heavy means, and we tend to say in Spanish, like rellenito, right? Rellenito, okay? Heavy. Fat, heavy. Eso podría ser la diferencia. Heavy, fat. Fat is another adjective. Heavy, tendemos a decirlo como un poquito, quizás menos de, de, de peso. Podría ser como lo decimos al buen salvadoreño, rellenito, ¿ok? Eso sería la, la equivalente. Okay, let's go. But thank you, uh, Ingrid, that's a nice example. Thank you. I will go with Kevin and then tell me. Um, my cousin is... Is short sure. and, and funny. And? and funny. Okay, nice. Thank you, Kevin. That is good. You're welcome. Tell me. Uh, my brother is chirp. Okay, yeah. 
Mason, thank you. Alejandro. My father is serious. My father? My father is serious. Okay, yeah. My father is serious. Is it for me? Alejandro, serious. 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 Yeah. Very good, Alejandro. Thank you. Let's see. I was trying to ask somewhere. Oh, Mercedes, please give me an example. Um, my husband is, is serious and good looking. Okay, nice. Better for me, I said it's husband. 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 Thank you, Mercedes. That is awesome. Uh, tell me, I think you have a question or do you want to help give us another example? Una pregunta, perdón. No sé si ya tenía la ronda levantada. Okay, I want to listen to William. William, can you give us an example, please? Okay, my my pet is black. Okay, yeah, my pet is black. Okay, okay, I will go with Claudia and Karen, but first, give me a second. I want to explain something. I, I listened to Kevin's example, and yeah, we tend to. We can give, you can express two or more than two additives in a, in a sentence. We're describing something. We can say, my mother is pretty and, and smart. Or we can say, my mother is pretty, is smart, and good looking. We can make some combinations. So we're expressing two identities, three qualities. I'll go with Claudia, then I will listen to Karen and Mercedes. Claudia? My cat is pretty and short and white. Oh, yeah, okay, nice, nice. Do you say pretty, sorry, pretty? Pretty. Okay, you can just cute. Cute, cute. Cute and cute is it. Yeah. Some people say pretty. Some people say pretty. Yeah. But it's much better if you say cute because cute is for, for animals. Right. All right. But it's nice. Take it love here. Let's continue with Karen. I am short and talkative. Okay, nice. Thank you, Karen. Mercedes. Question. Yes. Yeah. Es posible decir, por ejemplo, my work is heavy. My, sorry? My work is heavy. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's chair heavy. My, you say my work, right? My work. Work. Tu, tu trabajo, ¿verdad? Sí. Okay, yeah, my job is heavy. Heavy, or you can say uh, busy. Yeah, you can say heavy. Yeah. Heavy. Teacher, my job, hard, my work. I'm sorry? And hard, pesado, hard. Oh, high. High? Um, and no? Ash, A, RD. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, good, good. Hard. Yeah, you can say my job is, is hard. Hard is similar to, to heavy. Yeah, I, I will use hard. My job is hard. My job is hard. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for sharing that adjective. Absolutely. Let's see. Uh, well, I'm going to say this. Is it clear? Sorry. Yes. Okay, thank you. Edith, give us your example, please. Thank you. Uh, I have the question. Oh, yeah, tell me, tell me. Uh, para decir como extrovertido. Oh, okay. 
Again, you can say, my brother is extrovert. Extrovert. You can say it that way. Extrovert. Very good. Okay. Anybody else? Question? It's a question. I want to say else. Okay, listen. Now, in the last part, I know that, that it's almost time. We're going to practice with the conversation just with some participants, with a few participants. What I want to do, I need to look at the conversation and we're going to listen and practice with our classmates. I want to have you know some participants in the conversation because it's almost time. And what I wanted to do, I need you to pay attention to the conversation because we have here a real setting, a real scenario. Okay. And we have some questions that we were practicing previously. This is the conversation. Okay, so we have Chris and Jane. Right. They are, as you can see in the image, they are looking at pictures, they are looking at photos. Okay, and Chris is asking Jane about one of her family members. All right. Es que acá en la conversación, ellos están, Chris está preguntándole acerca de uno de sus, de sus familiares. Okay. Here we go. Listen to me first. Chris and Jane. Who's that? She's my sister. Wow. She's pretty. What's her name? Her name is Sarah. Oh, how old is she? She's 24 years old. What's she like? I bet she's sociable. Yes, she is. And she is very friendly, too. Okay? That is the way we include, you know, in this case, we're including numbers, ages, and adjectives in the conversation, okay? Well, I need two participants for the conversation. Who wants to help me? Yolanda, good. Yolanda, let's go with Kevin, okay? No bajemos la mano, voy a incluir los más. Or, vamos con Yolanda and Evelyn. Sorry, Yolanda and Kevin. Kevin, you are Chris. Yolanda, you are Jane. Let's go on the camera three. One, two, three. Who's that? She's my sister. Well, she's pretty. What's her name? Her name is Sara. Oh, how old? Um, sorry. Oh, how old is she? She's twenty-four years old. What's she like? If is she sociable? Yes, she is, and she is very friendly too. Thank you, Yolanda and Kevin, that was amazing. I will go with Alejandro and Rolando. Alejandro and Rolando. Okay, Alejandro, you will begin with the conversation and Rolando, you will continue, okay? So you will be Chris, Alejandro. Let's go on the camera three. One, two, three. Who is that? She's my sister. Well, she's pretty, what her name? Her name is Sarah. Oh, how old is she? She's 24 years old. What's she like? I mean, she's sociable? Yes, she is. And she is very friendly too. Thank you. Awesome. Let's go with Delmi and Jennifer. Delmi, you'll be Chris. Jennifer, you'll be Jane. Let's go on the camera three. One, two, three. Tell me, you're Chris. Kill me. How does? She is my sister. Wow, she's pretty. What's her name? Her name is Sara. Oh, how old is she? She's 24 years old. What's she like? I bet she's sociable. Yes. She is, and she is very friendly, too. Thank you, Jennifer and Delmi. 
I will go with Ingrid and Mercedes. Ingrid, you will begin. And Mercedes, you will be Jane. Tony, come on three. One, two, three. Who's that? She's my sister. Wow, she's pretty. What's her name? Her name is Sarah. Oh, how old is she? She's 24 years old. What's she like? I bet she's sociable. Yes, she is, and she's very friendly too. Okay. Yeah. Thank you, Ingrid. I will go with Eduardo and Fatima. Eduardo, you will begin. You will be Chris, and Fatima, you are Jane. Let's go on and come on three. One, two, three. What's that? She is my sister. Whoa, she's pretty. What's her name? Her my name is Sara. Oh, how old is she? She is 24 years old. What she like? I bet she's sociable. Yes, she is, and she's very friendly too. Excellent, thank you. Appreciate. All right, let's. I will go with my last participants. I'm going to select Claudia and Griselda. And also, okay, Claudia, you will begin with the conversation. Okay, who's I'm that? Gonna... Let go. Let's go. Sorry, who's that? She is my sister. Whoa, she's pretty. What's her name? Her, my, her name is Sarah. Oh, how old is she? She's 24 years old. Was she like either she's sociable? Yes, she is, and she's very friendly too. Thank you. Thank you, Griselda and Claudia. Uh, I have Oscar and Kevin. Kevin? Okay. Who is that? Let's go. Okay, uh, okay, okay. Let's go. <laughs> Who's that? She's my sister. Whoa, she is ready. What's her name? Her name is Sara. Oh, how old well is she? She's 24 years old. What's she like? I bet she is sociable. Yes, she is, and she's very friendly too. Excellent, thank you. Kevin, I think you have a question. Tenía una pregunta. Yo. Sí, porque vi que levantó la mano. Ah, no, es que te recuerdo que dijo de que no bajáramos la mano porque después no iba. Ajá. Entonces la volví a levantar porque no, no, no me acordaba. No problem, no problem, thank you. Okay, listen, repeat it for, repeat it for me. Fashable. 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 Another one. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? What's her name? What's her name? What's her name? Her name is Sarah. Her name is Sarah. The other one, the last one. I bet, I bet she's sociable. I bet she's sociable. Okay. Well, everybody, uh, any questions? Questions? Everybody? Not the shirt. No question. Yeah. So say, Teacher, I have yeah, a question. Yeah. What is the meaning bet? Bet. Mm -hmm. uh, well, that is when you say, for example, apuesto. Apuesto que es sociable. I bet. Eso, eso es Thank you. Teacher. You're welcome. Yep. Uh, the pronunciation is. I bet he's sociable. 
I bet. I bet. Ah, okay. I bet. I bet he's sociable. His or she's? She's. 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 Ah, okay. Yes. Es que a veces no, no se escucha bien. Eh. Yeah. Probablemente que se no se le escucha cortado. No. Uh, creo que un poco suave lo escucho, entonces no, no, no logro eh, ah. captar bien, bien. Yeah, but it, it says, I bet she is sociable. I bet he is sociable. All right, everybody. Preguntas, dudas, antes de finalizar la semana 2. Recuerden que mañana no habrá clases. Si descansamos igual, podemos aprovechar para ir avanzando. Si, si desean ir al mismo al ritmo, es decir, iniciar el lunes ya con la sección 4, o sea, el lunes, pero mi recomendación sería que iniciaran desde antes. ¿Okay? Igual, si tienen dudas o preguntas, estamos a la orden. Y la idea es que ustedes practiquen, hagan varios intentos. Si obtenemos todo de la primera vez, todo muy bien, excelente. Si obtenemos un error, por ejemplo, dos errores, recuerden que seguir los intentos. Y claro, es un buen trabajo. Es un buen trabajo. Si es que sigamos practicando. Si hay dudas, consultas, preguntas, etc., somos en la hora, ¿okay? Es que no olvidemos completar este día, las seis con tres. Hemos avanzado mucho más. Perfecto. Y el meter, ¿ok? Que es hasta ahora. ¿Ok? ¿Dudas, consultas antes de finalizar? No, teacher. It's ok. Thank you. Well, everybody, this is all for today. Thank you so much for being here during this week. We will continue next Monday with a new week. Please, everybody, stay safe. Have a nice weekend. Blessings to you and your families. Bye-bye, everybody. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night, Good night teacher. Bye. 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 Bye.